hey guys welcome back to my channel for today's video i'm going to be doing a set of nails with angels i'm going to start by applying a coat of dehydrator and after this i'm going to apply two coats of primer which is what i normally do I'm going to be applying a thin layer of clear acrylic on all of my nails and I'm going to speed this up a little bit to make this video shorter. I'm going to be using Glamming Glitz. I usually don't work a lot with acrylic, colored acrylic, I would say. I like using gel a lot better because I think it's easier when it comes to changing the design completely. So um, I'm going to be using that color. I'm using white acrylic. And I'm also going to be using Hot Girl from Nail Heaven. I'm going to be using both of the acrylics. I'm going to dip my brush in my monomer and I'm going to dip it in my white acrylic and my nude acrylic. I'm not looking for a specific pattern so I'm just going to set it and whatever turns out is going to be good for me. And now I'm only going to be applying a small amount of the Hot Girl Acrylic. For the next step, I'm going to encapsulate with clear acrylic. And what I'm doing here is cleaning my brush. This is something that I normally do after I'm done with every set and make sure that there is no residues left of the acrylic. And now I'm going to be making the clouds. I'm using French tips from DND. &D. I'm going to be using my dotting tool and going to make about three or four dots placed together. Uh, two clouds in each nail that I'm going to be doing the nail art in which is my index finger and my ring finger and I'm going to be using a makeup, makeup sponge to blend them downwards to make them look as if they are fading. I'm going to be using gold foil so I'm using my transfer foil gel and I'm going to apply it on all of my nails. And these are the nail tattoos that I'm going to be using. They are super cute. I'm going to leave the link on the description box if any of you are interested. And now I'm going to be applying the foil 
I'm going to crumble it up because I want it to break apart a little bit before I apply it because I don't want big chunks of it. I just want small sections. So this is the way I like to do it for it to look this way. And now I'm going to apply top coat on the rest of the nails and for our next step I will be applying the angels. And these are some of the angels that I decided to use. I'm going to cut them up and soak them in the water to apply them next. So now I'm gonna take off the plastic from the tattoos. That way it's easier to use. I've done it the opposite way and sometimes the tattoo sticks to the plastic and it makes it a little harder to remove. As in if you take off the plastic and they are on top of the paper, they easily slide off. So this is the way that I like to do it. So I've had them soaking in the water for about 10 seconds I would say. I'm using my tweezers because they are really small and it's hard for me to do it with my fingers. So what I'm going to be doing is trying to take as much excess water off of the paper and just going to slowly slide it off. This is how they look so far they kind of look like a 3d because of the glitter underneath and then the foils on top the angels and you know the extra touch of the clouds done with the gel polish i really really like these nails um i hope that you guys enjoyed this video and if you guys have any suggestions of anything that you would like for me to recreate let me know in the comments down below any questions, I would be more than glad to answer them. And I will see you next time.